So it's been a while since I've done myth busting. We're gonna do one right before this uh, jailbreak update, and after the jailbreak, we'll do another one. If you guys are new to the myth busting, basically uh, what you do is you come over here into my uh, Discord server. There's like a myth busting channel down here. You uh, type your myths over here. You see a lot of people type their myths in here. If you guys aren't in my Discord, make sure you guys join the uh, invites on the screen right now, and uh, let's go ahead and just uh, get started here. All right, so. Before we get started though, I know there's one myth out there, right? If you buy a bacon air plushie over here and then you also get the salad air one, or you get both of these guys over here, you get like, you know, uh, infinite health and joy store pass. You never do oof in there anymore, all right? Myth true, go check them out, link in the description down below. So the first myth for today is going to be by Pikachu. You're gonna need two people for this. Go in the helicopter, go in the rope, and then switch team and then ask the person driving you to press G while you switch team. All right, let's give this a shot here. All right, let me go ahead and uh, unlock the uh, chopper man. All right, somebody fly the helicopter. All right, I believe uh, he said to uh, get onto the uh, rope here. Okay, so now I'm on the rope. We're gonna go ahead and do a team switch. And uh, okay, I'm still inside of jail. That's not good. All right, a helicopter, fly on over here. We're gonna try a different way, okay? I'm gonna keep on trying this thing until we get it to work. All right, press G. This time, you know, will keep me on the rope until, you know, I switch team. Now I'm just dangling on the rope. We're gonna go out and go badoop and uh, press G not right now. Okay, I don't think uh, pressing G on the helicopter doing nothing, all right? It's really, really uh, weird. So, uh, yeah, I think he uh, basically assumes that, you know, we're going to uh, become, uh, you know, on the rope or in the seat or something. That, that's, you know, what I'm going to say, myth is true. Because other than that, I don't see the uh, any other point. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, I'm just going to, okay, press G. And, yeah, I don't think this myth is working at all. So this myth is, in fact, false. You cannot go, uh, you know, back in the helicopter pressing G, stuff like that. So the next myth over here is by Snoppy315. Uh, Helicopter gets shot down over trampoline and it'll go like boing. <laughs> All right, I need a helicopter over here. Okay, fly on over here and I need you guys to uh, clunk the uh, helicopter. All right, here we go. Somebody shoot down my vehicle. All right, let me go ahead and just, you know, chill on over here. This guy, okay, boink. Uh, whoa. <laughs> uh, I think it does go big boing. <laughs> Let me, uh, jump out of it and see what happens. All right, we're gonna slowly just fall down. Um, where did the hell eat? Whoa. Uh, we might have lost the helicopter here. <laughs> How is it still in one piece? How is this thing still in one piece, man? Let's try this again. Make sure that one time it was not, you know, a fluke. All right, let's do this thing. Okay, all the way over here. Uh, three, two, one, clunk it. All right, here we go. Whoa! <laughs> Well, there the helicopter goes, and it's gonna start flipping around. <laughs> we Wait, what? We died? No! No, how dare you, Asima? Why you make me die in a helicopter? I wasn't even in the helicopter. What do you mean I died from heli? I didn't take no fall damage. Bro, what the heck? Well, at least we know that the myth is, in fact, true. You uh, get shot down over the trampoline, and you go big boing. This next myth over here is by Unwanted Error. You go into the police team in jailbreak, go over to Army Heli, place a spike trap on the street, become a criminal, have the tires fly on the ground with the Army Heli, and it'll trigger the spike trap. So I'm gonna need a police officer here, okay? Somebody over here become police officer and let me, uh, whoa, let me use the Army Heli. Okay, police officer, I need you to place your spike strip right over here in the prison yard. I believe it works in the prison yard, uh, you know. Yeah, look at that spike strip. Okay, now we need the tires flat on the ground and just drive over it. It actually despawns. All right, try it again. Place that spike trap. And three, two, one. Ba -deep, ba -deep. <laughs> oh, man, this goes away. This is uh, pretty interesting. This is how we, you know, just uh, make the spike trap the complete literal scam. They don't pop the helicopter blades at all. The helicopter literally just cancels them. All right, you know, <laughs> spike traps cancel 2020, rip spike trap 2019 to 2020 or something like that, man. <laughs> oh, snap. But oop, <laughs> it's just gone. So this myth is in fact true. Running over spike traps with your army helicopter causes them to despawn. This next move over here is by Yeet King 64 Skydive and then parachute, take out a gun, hold you on a volt bike, and then something really, really interesting happens. All right, so... Let's get on over here to a volt bike. All right, we need uh, somebody over here. Uh, drop a volt bike over, like, you know, at the top of the 1M place or something. And while he gets himself the uh, volt bike, I need to get myself some guns. All right, now we're going to, you know, go enable parachute mode and enter the volt bike and see what interesting stuff happens. All right, 
Let's go into the army heli over here. Okay, we need volt bike guy. Uh, all right, where is my volt bike? Our volt bike is right down there. Get off the volt bike and make sure it's unlocked. And let me just double check that it's unlocked. Okay, yep, there it is. All right, there is a volt bike. So now, everybody back up. All right, I'm going to need to, you know, uh, come on this way. But oop. All right, enable the gun. And then, you know, I'll hold E. I don't even know what happened. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> All right, here we go. All the way over here and badoop. Get the gun and badoop. Um, did I get in the volt bike? I don't know. We need to get the volt bike higher up. All right, I think that's what we need to do. Okay, get the volt bike somewhere on like a hill or mountain or something like that. Let's try this thing one last time here. Okay, I'm gonna go all the way up here. We're gonna, you know, bail out this way. And nothing interesting happens besides I just get into the volt bike. So... This myth is in fact false. No weird stuff happens when you do the uh, special sequence of uh, commands there. This next myth over here is by Supreme Bacon Flakes X. You spam Q while driving a car. You get a speed boost without using any rocket fuel. Uh, I have quite a bit of rocket fuel here. Let me go ahead and just burn out all the rocket fuel. All right, this way we can, you know, prove that it's true without, you know, having any of the fuel. All right, let's see. Or we can, you know, just go really low over here and, you know, just start spam Q. All right. Actually, no, I need to burn out the fuel, otherwise he still uses it. Okay, now we go into a Tesla here. Okay, now we just spam Q and see if we get any faster. Um, I don't think we're getting any speed boost here. Okay, let's go ahead and just spam Q at stationary. All right, here we go. Will it continue going? Will it go? Nope, I don't think this works, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah, this, this doesn't seem like it's doing nothing. All right, we can go ahead and, you know, just give it a little bit of a boost here. Spam Q. Nope, nothing. <laughs> Yeah, that's a rip, man. We actually have to get ourselves some rocket fuel. Because with rocket fuel, you know, if we spam Q and stuff. Alright, you can still, like, you know, kind of fly. You know what I mean? Like, you know, like, it, it still somewhat moves. But without the fuel, that didn't happen. Alright, you can, like, spam Q a little bit like this. And then we go, you know, just keep on going. So, uh, yeah, I think that means this myth is, in fact, false. You cannot freeload rocket fuel like that. This next myth over here is by Wesley Gaming. Museum helicopter rope glitch still works when you go to the window at the back of the museum, drop the rope, and then, you know, uh, you just use a buzzard for this thing, alright? So, first step over here. I need to get myself a buzzard, alright? And then, like, I need a lot of people at museum as well. Okay, let's go ahead and try this thing, alright? We need to, uh, park the museum. We need to park the, uh, buzzard on the museum so that it doesn't fall. And then we grab ourselves a rope here. And, uh, I can't get off my rope. Why can I not get off my rope? Uh, this is already a little major problem here, okay? You can see over here, uh, yeah, I can't really get off the rope. Pressing space a lot right now. All right, other rope. Uh, come on over this way, all right? Real close over here. And I still can't get on the rope. That, that's just badonka donk. Okay, actually, police officer, oof me. All right, I need a police officer to go pew pew on the bacon air. All right. Now I should be able to... Okay, now we just leave the rope like that. Don't touch my buzzard. Okay, do not touch my buzzard. Okay, let's go ahead and try this again. This time we're gonna need somebody over here to be the uh, test dummy. Alright, this brocopter and everybody in it, jump out. Alright, jump out and just park it over here. Somebody grab a rope. Alright, somebody on the brocopter, grab a rope. And then wiggle, wiggle, wiggle until you're at the bottom there. Okay, I think we have ourselves a rope here. Somebody needs to oof the uh, police officer. Or police officer, reset. Alright, just police officer on that thing. Uh, okay, he got off. Now, let's rob the museum. Alright, we need some boys over here to come hold Alright, there's the stuff. Alright, we're gonna go, you know, just grab the museum. And we're gonna see if we can still rope ourselves out of the museum here. Because it'll be really amazing if we can... Because otherwise, you know, selfish people. Alright, where is this rope? This rope, did it despawn? Uh, oh, it's over here. It is over here. Okay, uh, stop moving the rope. Stop moving the rope, man. Okay, here. Okay, good. get off the rope. Get off the rope. Alright, come on. I need to get on over here. Hey, we got out of the museum. Woohoo! <laughs> this, this is pretty good. Yeah, I'd say this is pretty good if it worked for me. I mean, it might have taken a lot of police officers to coordinate it, but it worked. So, I ain't complaining. Now we just gotta see if we can actually go turn in this money here. So, uh, police officer, fly me to the museum. Okay, now we get on over this way, alright? You better be able to, you know, give me the money here, museum. Alright, boom. We didn't even have to pull the lever. 
I think this myth is in fact true. We can do the rope thing, albeit with like a whole bunch of people. But uh, we still robbed the museum, which is uh, real nice. All right? I like it when we can, you know, rob the museum solo. So yeah, this myth is in fact true. This next myth over here is by Max Ren C J F R, whatever his name is. If you start jetpacking and enter car and jump out, you jetpack and it'll glitch. Let's see here. Okay, got myself M12 Molten and Jetpack. All right, let me go ahead and I probably need to refill my jetpack here. Okay, now that we have some fuel, let's go ahead. Come on this way and, uh, whoa, M12. Don't bounce me like that. All right, boink. And, uh, okay, we entered a driver that time. I need to go in passenger, okay? Passenger is how we know that it glitches. All right, badoop. And, <laughs> um, uh, a little problem here. We're just, you know, boing, boing, boing. <laughs> All right, we need to try this with a volt bike. We have to. Okay, now that we have ourselves a volt bike, let's see if we can do this. And then, uh, can we steer it? Yes. All right. But volt bike does not go bounce. All right, that, that's a rip. All right, it used to bounce from the jetpack, but it doesn't bounce anymore. What about, like, other random vehicles over here, like a roadster or something? I want to see if we can get a bouncy roadster. All right, roadster spawn already. Where the heck is the roadster? All right, come on. Here it is. Three, two, one, and I love me some bouncy car. <laughs> Can't customize the passenger. Dang it, man. <laughs> but look at this. We're the we're bouncy roadster. Boing, boing. <laughs> this is absolutely hilarious. We're literally just bouncing random cars. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say that myth isn't back true because we are able to steer the cars into the glitch and bounce them around. This next myth over here is by 681769JC. Spam jump at the door of the cargo plane while in flight, you can glitch out of it, alright? Let's go ahead and rob this plane. I haven't done that in a really long time, basically since the boat came out, alright? Because boat just took away all the attention from the plane. So, let's go ahead and, okay, got ourselves a crate. Don't hold E on the thing, and all we're gonna do is just spam jump over here, alright? I'm gonna go ahead and jetpack, spam jump, whatever the case it is. And I uh, believe he did say, you know, the door of the cargo plane, which is uh, this thing at the hatch in the back. Yeah, this, this has to be the, the door. Okay, let's see over here. I'm gonna try, you know, uh, jumping around here this way. And uh, anything so far. Nothing, all right? Oh, uh, somebody with the key card. Hold it. All right, well, yeah, we have to hold the key card in order to bail out. There was no way we we're gonna, you know, uh, get out of there. Otherwise, we would have died. So, I'm gonna go ahead and say that this myth is, in fact, false. Because we had to use the key card eventually to bail out of the plane. And, uh, <laughs> we are crouching in flight as well. What the heck? That is really badonka donk, alright? So that means that this myth is in fact false. We cannot, you know, just uh, jump through the door of the cargo plane anymore. The final myth for today will be by t -prab Zero. If you use star code BACON, you will be a real powerful bacon. And, uh, alright, let's go ahead and try this thing out here. So let's get on over here to the uh, Buy Rooks menu here. Click here to add a star code. You type in BACON. You support, you know, the Supreme Bacon there. You follow through. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and cut through all that. All right, I just bought myself some Robux, and now I am Supreme Bacon Air. I am the Toilet Bacon. Oh, yeah, look at this. Look at this, man. I am, like, so good. This, this is just OP, man. Like, we're a flying bacon there sitting on a the toilet. There's nothing better than this, man. So, yeah, this myth is, in fact, true. Using Star Code Bacon makes you a better bacon, all right? So I guess I'll go ahead and wrap it up here for a myth busting or whatever episode we're on right now. <laughs> Make sure you guys, you know, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section down below you guys think. Leave your myths inside of the uh, Discord if you want to be featured in the uh, next video. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time.